What it do, everybody? This is your boy, LeVon Deuce, and I'm back once again, bro, with another video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button, bro. Turn that bell notification on, you know what I'm saying? Get notified every time your boy drop one of these. Today's topic, bro, chasing your purpose and not people. Reason being, bro, people come and go at your life, bro, but your purpose can always be there. Too often, people get caught up with relationships and friendships and you're making these people the center of your attention, bro, and you forget to get on your own shit. And usually when these people leave your life, you just be stuck there, not knowing what to do, bro, because you wasn't focused on your purpose. And one thing that's true about chasing your goals and being on your purpose, bro, and just growing as a person, you're either gonna outgrow the bummy friends that you had, or they're gonna cut you off, the ones that don't have the same vision as you. Because sometimes your vision can be bigger than theirs, and they won't they won't like that you know what i'm saying that can be the same with a relationship bro your partner can really just hold you down bro like they can just drag you down to the ground with them because they don't want to see you grow and do better i'm gonna give you a good example of chasing people and not your goals bro you ever sat back and told a group of your friends that you want to do something great or you had this great idea and they either laughed it off like it was a joke or discouraged you somehow or try to, tell you, try to tell you that it was impossible to do, and you kind of just brushed it off, and then y'all just sat back around and not doing anything. That's the wrong thing to do. That's definitely chasing people and not your goals, bro. Family members, friendships, your partner, anybody that's holding you back from becoming a better person, you gotta cut them off. Do not chase these people, man. Do not sacrifice your dreams and your goals just for the sake of family or the sake of a relationship or the sake of your friendship, man. I never met. It's a reason why millionaires usually cut off they bummy friends, man. Like, let that sink in. When you chasing your goals and being yourself for the ones that believe in you, they're going to stick right there beside you, man. You know what I'm saying? And they're going to push you. As far as the ones that want to walk away or you outgrow them, let them people be. Because as long as you're chasing your goals and you being yourself, you're going to attract new people and the right people to come into your life. You know, you're going to grow with new people. Like, that's just like the next levels. And sometimes, you know, with different levels, you got to leave people down here to make it to this level. You know what I'm saying? Or you can have that stupid crab in a bucket mentality type thing. And we all can just be sitting down here at level one. Nah, we all want health, wealth, and happiness, bro. And life ain't fair because it's a lot of people that sacrifice more than they should for folks that one did half of it for them. Don't be that type of person because people on the outside, you do got energy suckers, bro. And they will drain you, bro. Physically, mentally, spiritually, emotionally. They'll drain you just so they can try to make it to the next level. And bro, they'll leave you there in the dust, man. Don't be that type of person. Don't be no sacrificial lamb for another person. Like, this is your life. And your ultimate goal is to be happy and healthy and wealthy, right? Appreciate y'all tuning in to this video, bro. I know this was kind of quick, but I just wanted to kind of drop this one on out there. Don't forget to like it, share it if you could, and I'll see you next time.